talk about measuring the air coming from a diffuser. <clears throat> How many cubic feet per minute come out of a diffuser? Well, we can't really measure the area of the diffuser, be it this diffuser, or this adjustable face diffuser, or that round diffuser. We can't really measure it. So we look in a book of factors. This is for E.H. Price, because nearly all these diffusers are E.H. Price. So we look at the flow factor manual, and we see that for this, for this diffuser, the factor is 0.25. So the area, the effective area, is 0.25. I have this wand, which is, you could, use the, you could use the small wand, which comes in the box, or you get the longer wand so you don't have to climb up and down ladders, up and down ladders. So this is the ring we read, we read perpendicular, and it's saying 960 feet a minute. So 960 feet a minute. 940 feet a minute. Nine hundred and eighty feet a minute, and nine hundred and sixty feet a minute. So, if we average the four of those, we come up with nine hundred and sixty feet per minute times our factor of 0.25, and we determine that it's two hundred and forty cubic feet per minute coming out of this square diffuser. We can do the same with a. Uh, Adjustable face diffuser. The factor will be different because the ge geometry is different. We can do the same with a round diffuser. Measure. Measure four places around the diffuser. Take the average of the four readings times the AK factor from the book. That's your CFM. AK factor times the average velocity. That's as simple as it is to read a diffuser with a velometer. When you hook up the velometer, you hook up, and this one has a red and a black hose, but you hook up the plus side to the plus side and the minus side, of course, to the minus side if you're reading a supply grill. If for some reason you're reading a return, you just turn it around so that the plus is on the man minus and the minus is on the plus on the wand. This wand, if I have the, the little indicator on this side, the, the scale on my, my, on my bolometer reads up to 1250 feet per minute. If I turn it over this side, it, the, same, the next scale up reads 2,500 feet per minute, so it's pretty versatile. There's another one just like this that reads up to 5,000 or up to 10,000 feet a minute if you're testing dust collectors or things like that. But for most HVAC applications, you just need this one wand, and normally it'll be set at the 1,250 range. That's it for a diffuser.